The 2.5-hour documentary titled The Road to Freedom, Alama Mashriki's Historic Journey from Amritsar to Lahore, is produced by scholar and historian Nassim Yusuf, who is also a grandson of Mr. Mashriki. This clip, extracted from his film, provides a glimpse into the family background of Alama Mashriki. For a comprehensive and captivating exploration of Mashriki's pivotal role in the struggle for independence and social reform, as well as his lasting impact on South Asian history, we wholeheartedly invite you to watch the entire film. Alama Mashriki was born in Amritsar on August 25, 1888, and died in Lahore on August 27, 1963. He obtained his education in Amritsar, Lahore, and Cambridge in England. He came from a family with a lineage of ancestors and relatives who held important positions in the Mughal and Sikh empires. His father, Khan Atta Mohammed Khan, was a prominent figure in British India. Apart from owning rural and urban properties, he also owned the famous Urdu newspaper Vakil in Amritsar and was recognized for his contributions to literature and fundraising for the Hejaz Railway of the Ottoman Empire. He received a prestigious medal from the Turkish Sultan Abdul Hamid II of the said empire. Alama Mashriki's relatives were famous personalities. For instance, his son-in-law, Dr. Akhtar Hamid Khan, a Nobel Prize nominee, founded the Pakistan Academy for Rural Development, which later came to be known as the Bangladesh Academy for Rural Development, as well as the Orangi Pilot Project, both world-renowned projects. His sister Khadija Begum was married to the Prime Minister of Bahawalpur, Khan Bahadur Nabi Buksh. Additionally, his sister Aisha Begum's brother-in-law was the governor of Sindh, Sir Ghulam Hussein Hidayatullah. Several villages were named after Alama Mashriki's relatives, including Bayazidpur and Hamidpur in the district of Gurdaspur in India, and Sharifabad in district Nawabshah in Pakistan. Shafiabad Railway Station, also in District Nawabshah, was named after one of his relatives. 